Hey, what's up everyone? Hans is in Davos, Switzerland at the World Economic Forum talking 5G and the fourth industrial revolution. Our teammate Lauren caught up with him. Why Davos? Why the World Economic Forum? If you think about uh, you gather all uh, all world leaders here from business, from politicians, civil society. And the main team here is actually discussing the fourth industrial revolution, how it impacts the world, how it changed everything. And of course, in the core of that is technology. Uh, 5G is one of the themes mostly discussed in this whole event. I think that there are few companies in the world that is that prepared as we are and discussing that. With our breadth and our investments and our size, we have a huge responsibility for also broader questions in the world, what we can do when it comes to education, as we're doing quite a lot in the US, but also how we think about equality, important things that is happening in our society and uh, where Verizon should play a vital role. We've got the full interview with Hans on the web and Jeremy recently caught up with Diego Scotti to get a check in on how the Ad Fellows program is going. Hey, what's up, everybody? I'm here with Diego, uh, part of your marketing leadership event that's going on here at the Ridge. Uh, I want to get an update from you. How are the uh, Ad Fellows doing? Well, Ad Fellows, as you know, is a, is a great program. We are in the second year of Ad Fellows. We have 20 of them last year, 30 this year. And for us, it's very important because it's our way of bringing uh, diversity and expand our pipeline of diversity uh, for marketing across the company. Uh, these uh, fellows now are then their third rotation, so they rotate between Verizon and uh, eight of our agencies, uh, learning different skills, mm -hmm. and they are about to graduate in April, so hopefully a lot of them will get offers by that time uh, in terms of where to work in the Verizon ecosystem. I also have to say congratulations. Recently, the Ad Fellows Program and the marketing team uh, honored at CES. Thank you. That was yeah. a great honor. Yeah, great and honor. Uh, so I guess, what do the Ad Fellows think well, about all of this. I tell you, don't ask me. Let's ask them. Oh, hey guys, what do you think? <laughs> Seems like they're enjoying it. Now, hopefully by this time you've had a chance to visit allourthanks.com to meet, view, and share the team that wouldn't be here. It's the stories of 12 NFL stars who wouldn't be here if first responders hadn't answered the call. He's able to play this game that he loves thanks to the first responders that helped him. They have something in them that they want to give back to people. To all the first responders, you're the true heroes of this world. They are the reason why I'm here. Just, uh, just makes me thankful for everything that I have. Mm. What they do every day matters. We all owe them so much, especially my family great stories. And remember, for every share, Verizon will donate $1, up to $1.5 million to support first responders. And don't forget, Tuesday, January 29th is our 4Q results webcast at 11 a.m. Eastern. You don't want to miss it. Well, that'll do it for us today. Until next time, you're up to speed.